Hello there, everyone, and welcome back to Europa de Versailles 4, Spain. We are here with, well, as you saw, dangerously high overextension, rebels getting ready to rebel, and a general risk of all hell breaking loose. We are in the black monetarily for, okay, well, let's let that run one month, and maybe we'll see. But I think I'm going to need to recover, recruit some troops. Spanish Brazil is unhappy. As long as they don't declare an independence war, I'll be okay. What you doing all the way down here, Austria? You got a long walk ahead of you. Apparently you can't get out of the... Uh... All right, let's see if this number is... There we are, 2.85. All right, now where the heck are all my ships? Where the heck's my... There it is, the call-out bar. Fleet... Yeah, protecting trade node Sevilla, protecting trade node Genoa. And we are just not doing well financially at the moment. Although I could drop, I'm kind of scared to drop army maintenance too much right now, but we need a little bit. Counter-reformation. Pope gets happy. Austria gets happy. I get two extra missionaries. Oh yeah, missionaries. That's right, I've got, but increased technology costs could really hurt. Granted, I'm behind the times on everything, so... Might not be such a bad thing. I'm working on a diplomatic idea group right now, which is cool. That's going to get me some serious... That's going to increase my money quite nicely, so I'll, I'll be careful. That is some pretty nasty unrest we got started, though. Yikes. Oh yeah, a whole bunch of loans. Uh, we better just hold off. There's not much we can do. Let's see what we can do. Hopefully we can just keep things stable. Or handle the rebels. Let's see. Unrest. Yikes, yeah. These are some seriously unhappy provinces right here. I have to get rid of some of these... Uh, Yeah, we'll have to nail some of these, uh... Oh, God. Um, mercenaries. We'll get some of these mercenaries out of here. Let's see. Autonomy or administrative power? I need the admin power badly. All right. Well, hopefully... Damn it. I didn't even, uh... Jeez, you know what? This is so bad. I've got, it comes down pretty, it comes down even if I'm at war, I think. So maybe, I don't know, it would be nice to keep these, uh, hmm, uh, I can't afford to have some major rebellions right now, so if I can decrease their probability by a chunk, then once they're cored, it'll go down another tick, and I should be actually getting pretty close to okay. Let's see. Nationalism, intolerance. Overextension, yeah. Overextension is half of what you see there. So let's let things tick down a bit, and we'll see if we've maybe uh, helped the uh, situation a little. Not a lot. Lemkinian uh, nationalists are pretty bad. I just got a claim on Morocco's territory. Oh, well, yeah, now we got a cause for war. Province improvements. Alright, so I'm working on diplomatic groups. So we're not going to build any diplo buildings. Convert provinces. Which ones can I convert? Just what I need, right? More instability from... No. It's one thing at a time. I didn't realize I could do... Well, it might actually cancel. Okay, manpower, production efficiency, just plain old tax income. Ah, oh, I got those... 
It's one ducat, we'll do it. Those aren't cores, so we can't do that. Okay, let's, uh, all right, let's just let it go. Gotta be careful here. 11 ducats a month, it's getting better. Inflation is going down. I'm 1,500 in debt, that is nuts. Melilia is really bad. Okay, I only have two diplomats, so the question is who should we improve with? Austria is okay. Let's see, what's her relationship with uh, Naples? You still will not accept vassalization. You're just not quite, I'm not powerful enough yet, I guess. Let's see, who else are my... Oh, they're doing some random New World thingamajobber. This one is not a... Uh... Oh, no, it is It is a actual nation now. And they grabbed... Expansion ideas, nice. So they're going to be a pretty powerful little force. I should probably get the next uh, region underway here. Colonial region. Maybe we could start up on the west coast here, couldn't we? Britain's in. Well, let's start. You know what? Let's start in the Central America. Why not? How many colonies do I actually have working? I have one colony working. No, but I'm I'm broke. I'm broke. Stop right there. You're broke, Spain. Don't be silly. Don't be hasty now. All right, these are gonna take a long time to core, aren't they? Just have to hold it 15, two more years, wow. Are we not even, wait, is this one? Oh, we haven't even started making this one a core yet. Youch, because I don't have enough min points for it yet. Disputed succession. Oh, that's tempting. Ah, oh, yay, yay. All right, well, apparently I won't be getting the next diplomatic idea for a while. Let's see, covert actions. I could almost, I don't have enough prestige to do it anyways. Too bad. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll just let that go. <sighs> at least it's not a... At least I didn't lose... Um, oh no. Well, hopefully we are... Do we do okay on that one? Yeah, no problem. Yeah, so then Tlemkin will have to core it soon. This one actually is doing better. Not much better, but a little better. All right, I really need to recruit another basic trade fleet because I need to get more ships protecting trade here. So I'm, you know, I've only got a quarter of my bloody f limit of ships here. Do I have any policies I can take? Morale of, oh, Oh, I can't do that one yet. Morale of navies, national spy defense. Nope, those aren't going to help right now. Pomerania has sorted out their religion issues. Yeah, my overextension sucks. My colony is a little unhappy with me. And some of these rebels are getting dangerously upwards. Now, oh, yeah. All right, I don't, I'm not gonna free that one. Population, excellent. Okay, I can afford to send a new colony now. We'll get... Now what happened to my fleet? Let me guess, it croaked because I did not put it somewhere safe. Yep, that was brilliant. Brilliant, sat outside and uh, 
Got eaten alive. Okay. Just a couple of transport ships. Okay. Let's see, where's the fastest shipbuilding area is? Well, right down here on the coast. 182 days, looks like the best I can do. And we'll just build two cogs to uh, transport my armies to the mainland so that I can uh, proceed. All right, we just got to monitor our uh, revolt risk here. Okay, so if I harsh treatment, um, reduce the progress by 30%. That might be necessary. I don't... Yikes. Ah, uh, 50 military points. That's painful. Yeah. Alright. Harsh treatment. Let's see. Down to 40%. Okay. Or down to 30, so it's now the Moroccan Patriots who are only threatening to rise up in Gaharb. It's actually getting better. I just gotta hold it, hope that the dice rolls hold off long enough for us to get the uh, coring done. And that we can core. Let me see, which one is the more expensive one? 200 for Tlemkin. I think we better start that one. That is the most... That is a big chunk. That's 20%. I mean... Yeah, if I can get that one out of the way, that will help. Okay, I think I need to... Oh, I can't change my focus. I have no advisors? What? When, when did that happen? Alright, well, tax guy. Diplomatic... Ooh, that'll help. And that's all I can afford right now, but hopefully that will increase coring speed. I didn't even realize those guys had croaked on me. Shows how much attention I'm paying these days. Okay. Yeah, I think that just helped a lot. 15... No, it didn't really. 1551. Yeah. Still another year and a half to go. Oh, God. They're still making progress. Yeah, claims on provinces I do not own, that's nice. What's my mission right now? Mission? Oh, secure... Okay, I am... Okay, I'm working on that one. Good. Barring any disaster regarding, um... Future stability. Let's see, well, what's going to be our next move here? Well, okay, right, waiting on my ships. And monitoring the um, increasing disaster here. All right, might as well check our diplomats, diplomacy status. We have one, no, we have four relationships in this game. The most unhappy with us is uh, Portugal, who we have a royal marry with, which we will not one up when it ends. I suppose we could stop guaranteeing Portugal too. That might be useful. Okay, that'll uh, that's a useful thing for them to do. He's not gonna like that, but he'll deal. Those trade ships, they are protect trade in. Let me see. Well, let's see. Where's the gold coming from right now? We are getting eight ducats out of Sevilla of the money going in there. We are pulling one ducat of very little out of here, so we don't even need a, a guy here. How wealthy is this node? 7.8 in there. What's coming up through here? Three ducats there. How about the African node? This is out of range. It's, uh, we're getting 4% upstream there, and not a lot. Four ducats are coming up into Sevilla already, so that's okay. 
This is the overseas Caribbean node, which we actually have 25% control of, well, next to nothing, but we're not, or are we steering? Is that going the right place? Yes, it is. Okay, so we're not doing, we're doing okay. We don't have the best of the nodes, but if we're gonna continue pushing money forward, we might as well start pulling more money out of, I guess uh, siphoning off of Genoa will be the best bet. Okay, trade in Genoa. Try and overwhelm France a little bit more in there. Who are my rivals, and do I have them? I only have two rivals. Oh, I, I, I see a third rival. We could rival Russia. We could rival the Ottomans. We're not going to rival... Well, blockade, um, embargoing the Ottomans would be pretty useful. Russia has just gotten enormous. Yeah, the Ottomans, we have some trade. Yeah, we could compete with them. I mean, it's not like they're that close to us, so... We'll rival the Ottomans, and then we'll just get a little power projection by embargoing them. Issue an embargo to the Ottomans. Rebel Uprising, still progressing. 4.9 years till the next potential revolt. Overextension, we're about to core Tlemkin, which will be a nice one to have out of our hair. Yeah, we're just in a holding pattern right now. So, you know, it happens, it happens. Hopefully soon. I think next month I'll be able to do this, getting at least four per month. That was a heck of a disaster. All right, coring that. Mali is coming apart at the seams. That's cool. Oh, we are so close. And then we can start getting some religious unity going down there too. But we're going to have to fight uh, Portugal soon, which is a little unfortunate. Okay, which means we do need to record, recruit a uh, template name on the mainland, just gonna cost 192, which we don't have yet. Oh, apparently I had two other armadas underway here. I didn't even realize that I built, I guess I did that a while ago. Okay, you guys go to, we'll send you to the Canaries first, just to, uh, regroup and then we'll take it from there we're just waiting on the last ships for each of these builds 1550 and let's see did that how did that do I don't even know if those guys made that much of a difference there we're pulling eight ducats forward and 5.6 is remaining well, maybe we should pull some money forward into Tlemkin. We've got 9% of the total power here. And you know, half the money's still staying behind, so well, let's give it a shot. Why not? Take trade in Tunis. Because we do have a... We have a merchant there. It might help. 1.6... We've got 2% more power. You know, I should have looked at how much it was actually going to get us by doing that. Well, too late. Let's see. Come on, cores. Come on, cores. Oh, yeah, yoy. Yeah. 8.5% chance of progressing. Salt crisis. Lovely. Production efficiency drops. Garb is the only one that's at high risk of a rebellion, but we'll probably get them in a... S well, the other two might not, actually. If they get up to 80%, we're going to... Uh... Well, no, you know what? We got a... It's yours as well. All right, we're, com we're coming, we're coming. Let's uh, handle them. Harsh treatment. Alright, they're down to 60. 
Oh, Portuguese Patriots in Madeira? Which one is that? Oh, right, on the mainland. Jeez. That's, um... Shoot, shoot, I don't even know where that one is. Where is some traditionally Portuguese provinces? It's not that one. It's not Alenteo. Oh, hold on. Is it this island? It is this island, isn't it? Yep, it is. And are we coring it? No. That's going to be a pain to deal with. All right. Have some autonomy. I mean, seriously. And let's get a template name. 112 days. And, okay. Let's uh, recall our diplomat. Actually, yeah, let's recall him and let's see if Naples will actually accept something like uh, vas actual proper vassalization here yet. Come on, Naples. Love me. Love me. Love your overlord. Negative 62. Our base tax is just not adequate or something. How irritating. Well, you're still an, an ally and you like me, so that'll do for now. Portugal hates me. Austria could use a little work. Always use a little work. It's been a while since I've improved with you. And my third, fourth relationship is the Pope which I could get a little bit more influence by uh, improving with him, too. That would sure be nice if... Oh, who's, who's got me rivaled right now? And I'm being rivaled by France and Morocco. Would England actually want to be my ally? Oh, do they view me with distrust? Yeah. Oh, they got to reach. They're in a whole hell of a mess right now. It's so tempting, but we'll just. Hold on, let me check. They won't accept royal marriage, and I don't have. Yeah. I don't have the same ruling dynasty. Uh, if I could get a royal marriage, I might actually be able to... Well, let's, you know what, let's give it a shot. Let's try improving with... Let's do a little bit of ma machination. Let's uh, improve with Britain and see if they'll actually take a royal marriage. All right, let's see how our progress is doing on these various collapse of our uh, stability here. You guys are progressing in Oran. Are we coring Oran yet? I sure hope so, because I think that's one of I think that was one of the missions. Yes, it's almost cored, which will help immensely. Kalemkin is on the way, and the last one is Yeah, this one right here. Hundred and hundred more points. I think that'll be the last one we need to core. Yearly prestige or yeah. Fridman and money. Could use the prestige. Let's let's take the prestige. Alright, we are almost there. This year. Just have to hold out a little longer on these uh rebel rebellions. So when we take when we if, when we do war with Portugal, we need to make sure we take um, Portugal's little one province down here on the coast. The plan being, I might be able to, if I can't full annex them, I need to leave two provinces behind here. That's my plan for the next war: is to uh, do some serious damage to Portugal. Excellent. We're almost there. Oh, show superiority war in the... Oh, speaking of show superiority, there is my fleet going across to the Canaries.
We've got 13 troops out here. Is there any unrest risk here? If I take away my, my troops are providing positive stability, Portuguese culture. Now what's their negative 2.8? Come on, they're supposed to tell me. Oh, these are 13, oh, these are ships. Oh, those are trade ships. What are you guys, oh, you're, never mind, there's not an army here. That's my trade fleet protecting. Okay, speaking of which, let's see, so protecting trade. Uh, less than half a ducat in that node. Um, let's see, what other nodes? Alexandria would get us half a ducat, which doesn't quite pay for it. Bordeaux won't get us half a ducat. Safi, where is Safi? Where is that node? Is this, that is Safi, that actually would make a lot of sense. That'll get me one over a ducat and a half for half a ducat. That one will get me a whole ducat for half of, a whole. Yeah, that's not a bad one, too. Brazil, still not enough down there yet. Genoa will give us three ducats. Well, that makes a lot of sense, then. Go protect in Genoa. We should see that go from 8.16 upwards. Our royal marriage with Naples has just ended. Oop. Eight ducats was the magic number. Did it go up yet? No, it didn't. Did it go up? I didn't see if that went up another tick. Well, we'll go check that again. In, hold on. Did we, core, did we core? Not yet. Next month. 8.2. Eight point one seven. Did that actually go down? No. Really? Huh. I guess that would mean France is. Uh... Whoa. Claim all French lands in Italy. <laughs> the Italian wars were a series of wars between 1494 and 1559 that involved most Italian city-states. The papal state and drew in major powers like France, Spain, and the Holy Roman Empire. The early war, uh, earlier war of Lombardy against the Republic of Venice had left Dutch, the Duchy of Milan seeking an ally and turned to Charles VIII of France for help. Using the House of Valois' old claim to the throne of Naples as a pretext when Ferdinand I of Naples died, Charles invaded the peninsula in 1494 with his army, followed by uh, follow, with, his, with his army followed a large and mobile siege train battered down the medieval walls in a matter of days, triggering the reforms that led to the fortification style called Trace Italienne. Despite tactical victories in the field, Charles became cut off from France and was forced to return home in 1498. 61 years of war. We are interested in Italy. France already hates us so much it's not even funny. Um, we'll get a re-up our um, royal marriage with Naples here. Because, for God's sakes, we have... Yes, okay. Pause that. Send that royal marriage to Naples, unless... Did they, did they just send it? They did, okay. That's good. Let me see, and can we... Uh, an heir with a weak, weak uh, claim would do it. Um... Yeah, result in a personal union. Yeah, no, we're not gonna do that. We're not in a position to do that anyways. So, that having been done. Okay, where are we at with our um, overextension? And, well, okay, first the mission. Take a province from France, colonize a... All right, where do we, where's that? Alt, ah. Uh, Cresselia? Where is that? I can't even see it. There it is. Do we have a Treaty of Tordesias here? No, we don't. That is the... Um, this is... 
colonial range is 412. Where is this one? Oh, sorry, colonial ranges. I need to see colonial regions. I'll remember it one of these days. Layers, except cultures, climate, colonial regions. Hold on, that is the one that... Uh... No, wait, they got the Brazilian node, didn't they? They don't have one in Spanish Colombia yet. So... Hold on. Cannot be reached by any ports. Okay, let's uh, let's do it. You two, an automatic transport. Uh, these two, to here, and we might as well get two going. In a minute. Let me see. Let's see, let's see. Is there anything else? We have two more cores to make. Which one has bigger risk? Mm, the, let's do the one on the island just to get it out of my way. We'll take the mission to proper fleet, 75% for Navy tradition. For colonial enthusiasm, done. Counter-reformation, uh, I can't afford to. Stability gets more expensive. Yeah, no, we're not going to do those ones. All right, let's just uh, let that be for now. Okay. Yeah, they have just claimed all of our provinces. So let's see, diplomatic map mode. So we've claimed Ah, this one province here, that was probably not even... I didn't realize it. That was probably not worth the trouble. Hmm. Oh well. That's going to make life interesting. The uh, inevitable war with France will be inevitable. Naples won't come in. Why? They're threatened by me still? Good God, you guys. Would you get over it? Alright, well, England, we were going to see about getting a personal union with you. So let's um, get a royal marriage. Still won't accept it, huh? Still need some better opinion. All right, well, let's keep improving. Maybe you'll accept an alliance? Not yet. Even less likely to accept a alliance. They are at war with some people in the uh, New World that don't really matter. Okay. So the uh, revolt risk should be getting down there. Uh, harsh treatment, that one. Okay. Now none of these are to zero yet. So I think what we're going to do is we are going to go start hitting some of these provinces that aren't being cored, that, or that are core, and start converting them. starting with these two right here. 24 months to convert it. You know, I'm really tempted to just take that. Oh. Just to get this uh, going a lot faster. Embrace the Counter-Reformation. Well, I'm going to be bloody... You know what? Worth it. I'm going to be Catholic forever and a day, so we might as well get extra missionaries and just deal with the fact that we are going to be kind of out of luck on the front of... Um, let's just make sure, yeah, that one's, that one's being cored. Because now we're converting these in 27 months for that one. All right. So there's four conversions underway. <laughs> Spanish Brazil is almost under control again. All right, well, this is coming along. I think I'm gonna call it here, but I think I'm gonna need another, uh, another template name here soon. It would also be good if I could figure out some way to get my uh, income up a little higher. <sighs> Trade would be nice. 
but we're definitely not having an easy go of things. Great Britain could be a real hoot to play with that uh, end node there. But boy, if only... Why are you guys threatened anyways? Improved relations is high. Border friction is there. They want one... Oh, they want my uh, Sicilian provinces. I'm allied to their rival. Who the heck did they rival? The Pope. Well, the Pope is only a marginally valuable... Hmm, I'll have to think about that. The Pope is a one province minor that... Well, okay, two province minor. I could one-up that, re-up that for uh, Great Britain, for example. What's your relationship with Sweden? Oh, you've got a truce with Sweden. You're allied with Norway and Russia. Wow. But Great Britain, you would make a pretty solid ally because you hate France. Unfortunately, I'm allied to Austria, who is their other rival, which makes that bloody almost un uh, impossible. Not impossible, just very difficult. Of course, it means they're going to be trying to pull me in on opposite sides of a war. Goram at Naples, really? Well, I don't know. Who else would be power? Who else is pretty? Well, Austria's getting bloody huge. Holy crap. They've been eating. Yeah, no, Austria's going to be a good one to keep, for sure. We definitely want Austria as our ally for as long as possible. Wow, Calvary. What the heck? What a wacky map that is becoming. Sweden, Pomerania, and Hansa, they're not even caring. Well, I have, we share, common rival doesn't, yeah, I'm allied to, it's not counteracting me being, um, hmm, well, at least my army strength is starting to count for something. I don't know. Oh, there we are. Okay, there's, there's the extra money I was hoping to get out of that one. Cool. Just took a while to uh, push forward, I guess. Neapolitan pretender rebels. Funny. Very funny indeed. Huh. Wow. That's an interesting mess. The Ottomans are getting terrifying. Wow. Okay, the Ottomans are enormous. Look at that. Holy crap. And Crimea. I don't know. Sweden might be actually... Actually, Sweden. Is there anything that I'm doing that you hate? Distance. Religion. Oh, they're Protestant. Of course they are. All right. Something to figure out in another the next episode. <laughs> Thank you all very much for watching, and I will see you next time. Bye for now.